What's up everyone? This is me, Sean, and welcome to CES. Now, if you're wondering what CES is, is C C E gr grammar? Hello? Okay. CES is a Minecraft adventure map that takes place in space! So, yeah, basically you are a mechanic sent up to fix a space station and you find some hidden secrets, so... Yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead, I'm gonna get started here. Also, I want to go ahead and apologize right here at the beginning of the video for not uploading recently. I just haven't had the time to make videos. But I should at least get two or three videos out of this one. So, I'm hoping to have at least a week's worth of videos done tonight. So, just just cross your fingers. Hopefully I'll have some videos pre-recorded. But, yeah, let's go ahead, let's get right into it. Okay, your game mode has been changed to adventure mode. Main facility call room. Okay. Alright. Let's check what's in the chest. Also, it's like black and white in here. If you if you didn't notice. Everything is going to be black and white except for my skin. My skin is the only color I will see. I guess. So, yeah, let's go ahead and let's read what the book has to say. Warning. <clears throat> what voice should I give this guy? Hmm. Hold on. Okay. <clears throat> My name is John. No. I'm gonna give him a, a deep voice like this. Okay. Ready? My name is John. And if you are reading this, then I am here to tell you to avoid this place at all costs. This voice is not in my throat. I was just a mechanic invited here to fix the main core engine of the facility. As I've progressed through, I, I realized this place is a goddamn ghost town. <coughs> my, my voice is giving out. I can't do that. Okay. <clears throat> I, managed, I managed to write this letter and reconnect the facility's hopper systems in hopes that it'll lead to the main entrance, entrance chest. Do not pick up the key and do not follow what they say. You will get trapped in there and be slaves of theirs. Oh. Uh, okay. Isn't that cheery? Okay, so he told me not to use the key, but I'm gonna use the key. Dang it, because I am a person and I do things. <gasps> oh, that's so cool. It's earth. It's earth. It has dirt. It's kind of earthy, like dirt. You know? Alright. Let's just keep going here. This is pretty cool. Man, I actually really like this. Core room. Okay, so I have to fix something in there, probably. What's in here? Core room resources 1, resources 2, 3, 4, and 5. Okay. What's in here? Core restabilizer room. Authorized staff only. Also, I'm not setting up straight. I should do that. <clears throat> if the following blocks are not red, the core is not stabilized. Oh, if the following blocks are red, the core is not stabilized. If the following blocks are green, it's stabilized. Okay. Well, let's check out these resource rooms real quick. Okay, you got you got a bunch of redstone. What else you got? You got this iron pickaxe. Okay. So, okay, <laughs> is that to get through the door? I don't know. All right, room do. What do you have? You have nothing. Room do, do, or whatever, however you pronounce it. Three, nope. Four, nope. Five, no, 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 nope. No. Okay, no. Stop it. No, let me through. Dang it, door. All right. So I'm guessing this iron pickaxe is going to be used to... No, it says it can break blocks of redstone. Am I going to need them or something? Probably. Okay. I don't know. Let's go ahead. Let's just mine these. Boop. Okay. Do I mine every other redstone block in this these rooms? Hope not. Okay, no. How much redstone do I need? I think I need to figure that out first. So, let's go to the other side and see if the other side has some information for me. Please, other side, have some information for me. Okay, what you got? What you got over here, huh? Gordon? Oh, we got, uh... We got... We have, uh... Beds here. Alright, what do we have? Gordon's diary and cobwebs and a photo of a... S from a special someone. Do, do I want... Okay. I'm just gonna do that. Alright, I'll read his diary in a second. I'm gonna check all the other chests. We have dead bushes and white tulips. And then a book, John's private book. Okay. Anything else in here? Uh, lapis lazuli. Core coolant. 
can be placed on block of iron. Thank you. And Bill. By Bill. He has he also has some fish. And some apples. I will take all that. Thank you very much. Oh man, that's actually really good. Okay. What else you got? Sticky pistons, repeaters. I think I'm gonna need all this eventually. And a happy pumpkin. Yes! I have a companion. Happy pumpkin. What am I gonna call you? Hmm. I'll call him. I'll call you Joe. Alright? No, no. I need a better name. That's a bunch of binary. Whose room is this? George and David. Okay. What am I gonna call him? Well, if Joe's too generic, George is just a little less generic. So I'm gonna call him George. Okay? He is George. He's going to be my companion. He will never not be in my uh, hotbar. What was I talking about? George. Okay, George. George is good. Uh, scared by Jennifer. Or scarred. Sca sc scarred. I don't know. <laughs> it doesn't matter. Okay. And no. I'm not gonna drink that. Okay, let's read. Let's read Scared by Jennifer. Sorry. First month here, and I really don't like the personalities of these guys. All of them are weird in a different way, and I'm not. And I'm starting not to feel safe in this facility anymore. Ooh. Okay. What does jo or What does Gordon have? Okay. Dear diary, today's been a tough day at work. Worked on that dang core all day. I couldn't even get a, the break or the smallest break. Sorry, grammar. Another day, another great experience in the fluid flex facility. That is a tongue twister. Okay, John. What does John have to say? Uh, that's getting blurred out. Okay, these guys have been driving me freaking crazy since I started working here. Nothing but hard work with no reward every day for 12 hours. This day couldn't get any better, could it? No. No. Okay, Bill. What does Bill have to say? Oh, to heck with it. I'm in charge of this place. <laughs> uh, again, for the third... For the third time this week. I'd better take good care of it. Oh, I don't even know. I don't care. And we have binary. Fluid flex makes me happy. It makes us all happy. They've granted us nothing but love since we first arrived here. We love fluid flex. That's computer code. Okay, those two guys were robots. <laughs> Alright, core cooling room. Let's go into you. Place coolant here. Okay, coolant placed there. Oh. The core has been cooled to an optimal level. Okay, can I now go in there then? Please tell me I can actually go in there. This face is just beautiful, isn't it? Okay. Alright. Is it open? It is not. Is it okay over here? It is not. Mm -hmm. Can I not cool it anymore? What am I supposed to do? I do not understand. Do I place it more? Do I spam it? What do I do? I am genuinely confused. I cannot place it anymore. It's just a lapis lazuli block. Oh well. Okay, oh what's in the furnace? I didn't check the furnace. There's nothing. Okay, great. Lovely. I'm a little bit curious now. Where do I have to go from here? I don't know. Do 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 what do you through the rest of blocks trying to find secrets? Are the secrets? I don't see any secrets. No secrets so far. I have a feeling that room 5 has the secrets. So I'm gonna go there. Do I mine all the redstone blocks? I have a feeling I have to do that. Just maybe. Just maybe. Okay. But nope. Boop. And out. Oh man, more redstone. There's so much redstone here. Why is there so much redstone? I don't understand, game. Game, why you, why you redstone me like this? Maybe I have to mine all of it? I'm not too sure, though. That's the only thing I can do, though. This is literally the only thing that I can try. Is mining every single redstone block. That is it. So, I'm gonna do it. Alright, core has been stabilized successfully. No! George! Not George! <laughs> It's 
all gone. No. No, all right, stabilize. Can I now go in here? Please. All right. No, I cannot go into the core room. So where can I go? Aha, this door is open. Sweet. What's down here? Let's open this. Panic by Jennifer. Oh. Okay. Okay, hold on. I finally managed to cool and stabilize the core. These guys could be anywhere. Anywhere, anywhere, anywhere. I need to find a hiding spot fast. Real fast. Oh my gosh. Why is this happening to me? A certain clip of mine comes to mind from a certain Skywars video. Panic! Run! Panic! Run! Panic! I don't know how long you guys have been around, but if you've been around for that long, thanks for not uns unsubscribing immediately. I can't say that word for some reason, because uh, I don't know. Patience! Okay. Uh, serum information confidential. Okay, this is going to be some weird stuff. Okay. One, uh, four, th three, four, five, and seven. Okay, let's read them in order. Patient one, Fluid Flex Technology. Patient one, George Allen. Uh-oh. Is that Tim Allen's brother? I don't know. It seems that George has been reacting well to the serum, marking as successful forever Fluid Flex. Uh-oh. Fluid Flex Technology. Patient three, Robert Rolland. Okay, pa I also said three and I shook my head like that for some reason. Robert has not responded well to the serum and has gone he has gone completely insane. Marking has failed forever fluid flex. Uh-oh. Fluid flex technology. Patient four, Gordon Chester. A few days after the administration, Gordon has responded to the serum. Marking as successful forever fluid flex. Okay. Oh no! Fluid flex technology. Patient five, Jennifer Rogers. Jennifer has not responded to the serum at all. Her sanity remains same, marking as failed forever fluid flex. Patient 007, John Perry. Due to the complications, John hasn't re responded well to the serum. His sanity is slowly fading away, marking as failed forever fluid flex. That is not good. That is not okay. That's bad. Okay. Confidential and serum information. All right. To Dr. Smith, Doctor, I'm sending this message regarding the new experiment serum you have created. It appears to have low chance of functioning on healthy young people under the age of 35. We would like to announce you... We would like to announce you that there is nothing to worry about and the serum only improves from here on. Brainwashing isn't an easy task. We're all working hard here, after all, Doctor. Progress has been made. The serum has been upgraded. The serum is now ready for delivery. Reply to this when you can confirm it. Or when you can, so we can confirm it. Thank you. Uh, that is not okay. So, brainwashing. And we have... Uh, laboratory key, jumping serum, and speed serum. Okay. Alright. Next book. Oh, what is this called? This is called Serum Information. Okay. Experimental Serum der der Derivery. Delivery complete. Hello, Doctor. I've... I've seen you... I've seen you noticed our letter and confirmed the delivery. At the moment, two experimental serums have arrived. The jumping serum, when administered drunk or held in the hand... The serum will make a patient jump higher, okay? And speed will make the person run fa faster. Faster. Oh, I guess these are now like tools I can use throughout the map. That's cool. Okay, Fluid Flex Laboratory. Let's go in. Even though we probably shouldn't. And this is gonna be a doozy.